Look, gummy bears that are Christmas colors. That's so cool. stars do you give cool greens? I don't know, it was weird because after we ate there we all got sleepy and it never happens to me. But we got sleepy like an hour after. I don't know, maybe it was really good because it's like making us more aware of our bodies. And I feel like junk food gives you like this synthetic feeling. I give it four stars because the food was very high quality, the food was very healthy, and I think they had good flavors. I just felt like the person cooking our food today just happened to not be a very good cook. I don't know, he seems like he's the normal cook there. Anyway, the ingredients were high quality and I thought it was a great restaurant. And the prices were fair, and I think we'll go back next time we're in the area. It was alright. We've been eating at home a lot lately because it's just so much healthier and more affordable to eat at home all the time. And going out to eat, you never know what you're gonna get. Especially Especially if you're trying a new restaurant you've never been to before, it's a gamble. Like, it could be good, but it could be bad. Usually it's not very good, actually. We're used to more clean, home-cooked style food, so we don't like eating out much. Let's go again for another Costco grocery shopping haul. But before we do so, we're gonna check out the pianos. <laughs> I just found spiced apple cider. I guess it's a seasonal thing, but I'm really excited to try this. It's cold pressed, so it's like very healthy compared to a regular apple cider. But I can't wait to try this. It has apple, cinnamon, and clove. Vegan sausage patties, get it, get three of those. They look delicious. So excited. Yeah, I just noticed this. I've always loved root beer since I was a kid, but the only problem is I stopped drinking it because now I don't drink, I don't eat sugar now. I stay away from sugar. However, this says zero sugar. So I was like, okay, so what is it, aspartame now? But I checked the ingredients. It looks like it's sweetened with erythrol, stevia, and monk fruit. It's colored with natural caramel coloring, natural flavors. I'm gonna give this a try. I usually stay away from sugar, but this is worth it. All the cool kids drink this. Really? I've never heard of it. It's an energy drink or what? Tell me about it. It's a clinically proven. I guess it burns, I didn't know that. I thought it was just green tea. Should we get it? You wanna try it? We should do a review on it because right. everybody's drinking it. Really? All right, let's try it. We're gonna try it and not only try it, but we're gonna review it. That helps you burn body fat and accelerates the metabolism. This is our favorite soup here at Costco. It's a pho soup and it comes in little individual package bowls. It's a Vietnamese pho and it tastes better than any pho restaurant we've been to. Because it's important. How many uh, boxes should we get? We should get three. Three? Three boxes. Because it's so good, we're gonna finish it. Let's try it. I perfected it. Okay, so we're trying the silk almond creamer with our coffee. Oh, it's so good. Is that the creamer that's so sweet? Yeah, but I added more coffee, and so it's perfect now, right? It's so good, but I think it needs more coffee. French vanilla, right? No, I use this one. Organic. I'll try that, but first, today we're doing a Sprouts grocery haul. We're one of unique because we're going to try every non-dairy vanilla ice cream here to see which brand is the best. So this is a non-dairy option called Coconut Bliss. It's not only non-dairy, but it's also organic. We were gonna try the So Delicious, but I never liked So Delicious ice cream. I always thought they tasted weird. There's this brand I've never tried before called Oh My. It's also dairy-free. I'm really excited to try this because for the sweetener they're using, this one uses cane sugar. However, this one is using agave syrup. No sugar added, just agave syrup. Today we're gonna try this oat milk yogurt. This looks amazing, right? Mm -hmm. So Sharon found this and I think it's a very good find. An oat milk yogurt, I've never heard of it. Can't wait to try it. I'm sure it's gonna Sounds taste really good. Sounds lit. You got three different flavors. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna try... Strawberry, blueberry, and tropical? Vanilla. So if you guys wanna know what we thought about these, ask us in the comments and we'll be happy to let you know which one is the best. My mouth is watering. All right, let's go try these. They have some Christmas colored candy. That is so cool. Look, gummy bears that are Christmas colors. If I was a kid, I'd be going crazy right now. 
So now we're back home and we're about to try this delicious looking oat milk yogurt we just got and we've never seen before. It's like a new product. Strawberry hibiscus flavor. That's some interesting, very original. It's pretty good. It tastes like real yogurt, but better. How does it compare to that coconut milk yogurt we used to like? Um, this one's thicker. So is the flavor good and the quality is good? Mm -hmm. Would you recommend it over coconut milk yogurt? Yeah. Yeah, I've always liked oat milk. It's the best non-dairy milk, right? Yeah. 